Right, it's another day on the Suzuki. I've uh, been spraying the tanks. I'm, I'm, I don't profess to be uh, a painter. I'm an engineer by trade. Right, painter is just something I picked up. I've never done this before, which is uh, base coat and lacquer, because this is a metallic colour. So you have to apparently use base coat and lacquer. I usually use solid colours. I, I can get paint on and I can uh, make a reasonable job. Uh, what I've done here is um, took the Suzuki petrol tank down to uh, burr metal which would have been this this is a Yamaha one. That's the Yamaha I'm going to do next. Take it down to burr metal like that. Don't shot blast them. I use a heat gun and a wire brush, revolving wire brush in a in a drill. Don't like shot blasting. So <coughs> get it down to burr metal and then fill any any holes in. Uh, prime it and you had, had to do it about three or four times because there was a, a, a large dent in I'm not sure if it was this side or the other side don't know I can't see it anyway there was, there was a dent in one side earlier like a, a crease I couldn't get to it to knock it out so I've just had to fill it out and what, the first time you, you, you spray it and you put uh, undercoat on primer on it shows all the blemishes up so I've had to do that about probably four or five times and then I uh, when, when I was happy with the filling I sprayed this silver in here with aerosol right and then mask it up and then spray the base coat on and then the black line is um, tape and I'm going to lacquer all that now to seal it up if I had any time to do it again, I wouldn't put that on with tape. I'd uh, mask it up and spray it in because trying to get around that corner with tape is not great. So I'm hoping it's going to seal it up with um, with the lacquer. So those are them, and then I've got this up here too, so I don't need handle them once I've put some lacquer on. It's a it's a job. I do, I like doing everything myself and I very rarely get it perfect for several reasons, mostly it's because I haven't got the facilities because I'm spraying outside, I don't like to spray inside the shed or the garage if you want to call it because of the, um, the fumes and, and the, you know, the, the solvents. Uh, so I sprayed out, after I decided to spray it outside, I do use a mask, I have a respirator um, but it's insects, it's just the conditions I've got a, an umbrella up here which is shading the tank from the heat of the sun because if you, I haven't, when I've sprayed before and it's been too hot the paint dries before it gets on, on the, wherever you're spraying and it ends up like you strike a match on it, it's terrible so you, you don't want to be spraying in full sun. So I've got my umbrella up to to uh, protect it from the sun, and hopefully it'll also protect it from insects going on as well. Because if one an insect goes on, you really are knackered. So I don't, I, I can't get a, pro, a perfect job because I haven't got the conditions, but it's suitable for me. <laughs> 